It's commonly the case with retailers that uh, they don't link in existing Revit models uh, from which to start their store design from. Um, and asked why, they would generally reply, well, the design is too big, uh, the file is too big, it just makes our computer sluggish. So I thought I'd have a look at how would a retailer, for instance, get one store the components out so they could link that within their file. Um, and to achieve this within a ground floor plan view, I've created a section which I have named section retail and in a 3D view we can right click on the view cube and say orient to view section section retail that will set the view cube to only show the interested area that I'm interested in you don't see the view cube, uh, click on the light bulb, might have been hidden in this view, and one can adjust this accordingly. And one can just see the area that one is specifically interested in bringing into one's own model. <coughs> Next, select everything within this view now. You can see that the model elements are selected, and we can uh, unpin them and then group them. Once the group has been created, it would be a simple matter then just to write the file out into the and to link that into the other model. Group name is going to be retail out. If necessary one could of course copy the original file or if it was a central file detach from central and save as a new file before doing this. Edit group. It all looks good. Now that uh, the group is created, we can list it within the project browser. And here we can see the retail art group I've created. Right click and save group. <coughs> this will now allow one to save out this file as a Revit file. And save. Right, then what we can do is remove from the view the section box to see that the entire model is still there. It's just a part of this model that we have decided to save out. Going into a new model, one can now insert that Revit file as a link. I'm going to go origin to origin and there one can see how a reduced amount of elements were written out for us to deal with. So this would make the file a lot lighter to handle within our um, project into which it is linked. So don't shy away from big files, just isolate the area that you would like to include, write it out as a group, and save that group as a Revit file, and link that within the group that you need to work in. <coughs>